Uh, my name is Kobiche, and uh, I must say I'm thankful to God for how far He brought myself, and I'm sure equally, Harriet, uh, you are blessed. Well, I feel blessed. Mm, I feel you. blessed. Thank I you. I blessed. just want us to have a, a very short conversation mm. about uh, this whole Endeavor 2023 mm -hmm. and how we even got here. First of all, personally, I want to say thank you to uh, Her Excellency, the High Commissioner from South Africa to Ghana, right. Madam uh, Grace uh, Janet Jace, uh, Mason, for mm -hmm. the opportunity given to myself and whoever who's on board uh, to join this trip. Uh, how you feel about all when you heard the news about coming to Endeavor Festival? how was your mind program and how, how are you ready for this? Well, let me also extend appreciation to the High Commissioner of South Africa to Ghana, Her Excellency Grace Janet Mason, who is um, one of the working um, um, High Commissioners ambassadors, uh, diplomats representing South Africa. She's pushing the South African agenda and we are happy. I am happy to be part of this um, event, the travel event, because there is so much that we will be talking about subsequently as we go on with our conversation. Mm. Thank you. So um, let's look at um, the reception, the welcoming of the whole event uh, yesterday prior to we even coming on uh, today. Yesterday, how did you have a feel of the welcoming of the whole festival? Well, the, it is um, Africa's Travel in Daba 2023. This is an event that happens every year. Every year, so oh, yeah. this one is not the first one. It's mm. not the maiden one. There have been subsequent ones before mm. this one. And of course, I understand um, COVID um, sort of pushed things back a bit for them. I went in I think, two years ago. Um, they had to take a break because of COVID, you know, but we thank God that finally COVID seems to be out of the way. So this has even paved way for them to prepare and come out stronger and project South Africa's travel industry. Um, Enra opening was very good. It, it was, it was, it was mind blowing for me. I, I had never seen anything like this. And as we continue with our, you know episodes or experience mm. i'm still there's more there's, there's more to there's share more, there's, there's more, more to, to share. share there's more mm. when it comes to tourism exactly. in, in south africa and the interesting part of this thing is any south african wow this is extended to the rest of the african Africa. continent yeah, yeah. so and yesterday when i had the opportunity to interview one of the top executives for this particular initiative he was telling me that this is an african platform and I loved the, the way he went about it and the way he, he's asking Africans to take ownership of this kind of, of, of platform. In Tikobi, for me, mm. this has been an eye-opening um, and a great experience for me. And I'm excited because it's about Africa. I am excited as well. <laughs> now, I want us to uh, delve the conversation into, uh, during the grand opening uh, yesterday, the um, tourism minister made a very profound statement on how the African countries can open their borders and allow people to travel freely because it looks as if it is very difficult in people getting visas to travel to um, the neighboring countries, countries for tourism. Mm -hmm. I know, yeah. what, do you, what, do you, what do you think about that? And then I will share a bit to me, yeah, because we call Togo, or do border near Hano, we call Nigeria, or do border near Hano, be back Ghana, like all those systems. No, I then a bit to me, yeah. Yeah, you know, I to any able to to me two coin for African countries because Obi Kwa Bujra, Ebiana, or no befun easy. But yeah, I can see a crumb and you can add as a well given some mastery. Kobi, first of all, let me establish the fact that tourism has become highly competitive globally because it 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 is one of the areas for a serious revenue generation for every country it is the one of the backbones for every country's economy it right now a lot as of we money. speak a lot of money comes from tourism in see apart from the fact that africans yanka sayawaya problems already as a continent mm. you know and then on the domestic level as countries and so yanka sayawaya problems already now you know yesterday when i sat in the meeting the opening ceremony and i was listening to the you know the minister yeah. and other important um high profile personality um give their uh, speeches one of the things that ever meet him is that dia tina semi african now once we african na semi ba ukroma 
and this thing is beyond the tourism industry exactly but i you know what very, very i'm just gonna um tread cautiously but um south africa is very deliberate about its tourism mm. industry the reason here on we initiate is a a visa waiver agreements you no know, with so many other African countries. Mind you, and you're done on but Ghana, they don't say, I'm sure, my, but I was a man, I approve. It's an officer to me, come with some. And one year, baby, who comes is yes, I'm a show on, sir. In Sino, or Bass, yes, eh? Sir, visa waiver agreements, no, and more, you know, or money quite a number of African countries, Kenya, um, Rwanda, Zambia, Zimbabwe, quite a lot of countries, and it assigns our agreements, you know, which has taken, um, it, it, it's effective as we speak. Hey, it back. is people coming yes. into the country without visa. As soon as you get to the airport or wherever, you are, so let's you know, talk about Ghana. Let's, let's, let's talk about Ghana. Your problem, like no, your problem, no, problem, no, your problem, no, say, yeah, you introduce it. Measures now you can see the coin in now. Now you understand the measures and barriers. If you see your your whole point, what's the South Africa mau coin ever mukum? They have initiated this kind of policy, which is the visa waiver agreement, exactly. and this is extended to so many, extended to so many other African countries. Now you in Ghana for no more the same policy. Now you have to not say. I'm a Mikaita, I'm a Ramaphosa, um, president of South Africa. Eba Ghana, no. I'm a Grace Mason, High Commissioner, no. Omu pushi sa agenda ne Ghanian side, no. So e pushi ya masi say no. Yet na say we be biya. If a Ghana for South Africa ye ni biya we o. We be so mo say oh, eche Ghana abayensa. I mean, besides, eh, see, we, and yet the same thing, and for four for so tonight in a table, no, so almost in the sign, and I heard, you know, they didn't come with any specialty, and I anything further than the other. Uh, Harris, I don't know whether you have an idea, but the, the information I had was that South Africa for no, I can say, remember, in 90 days. Which and like, like, like three months, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Okay, with your crown, shanking it between my ninety days. But Ghana, I extend it to ninety days. Saying shanking with me every two days, with me yes. every three days, but maybe one week. Because I'm real and I'm jolly. It is a South Africa man in ninety days, sir. Yeah, yeah, by any person, I say, I'm up at one eighty days. Debbie, I don't know. First of all, ninety days, one eighty days, you know, a day, a day, a day. No, Kobe, first of all, one eighty days, ninety days, no crano. Yen, yen, and pilot, see, yen, who how I be see a whole. Even though discussions around that area has you know have been sealed but okay so i'm up 190 days and i'm up 2000 days but i'm with 90 days now yes yeah, yes because when you're it's the same country be a person who might be a bad yeah of course especially yes. right now i think it's not pretty it's tough not, everywhere it's on the 90 days i'm our Let's see how it goes. But more than ninety days. Most of the people here. Kitu ano kwa ano yenyo huwa wa ebesi yako yenim ako yano. I think sako biwe enkomobia personally, you know, because of my relationship with the diplomatic corps and then also um the um Ghana's um the foreign mission a uh, committee our foreign affairs committee our parliament Nintei, i have decided to take it upon myself to explore further because you if you are not maybe to. i could cause <laughs> okay, by okay, okay, so maybe say in as much as the benefit of the doubt problem, <laughs> 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 yeah, okay. it's a huge problem when it comes mm. to relations between ghana and south africa no the reason why i'm worried is that we are coming from west africa and we are representing ghana ghana as well in this festival and as much as that we personally are acquiring knowledge mm, mm. we must also make sure that we also use our platform to, to share push, to share to push mm. a certain agenda inform educate exactly so we are talking about tourism people mm. because when i posted on my platform people were saying yeah south african high commissioner she mentioned even yesterday minister for tourism oh, no, yes madam patricia de lili mm. ekaese a serious problem for african countries yes or more implement meanwhile we are here promoting policy. Tourism. You don't go through that much stress. Who meet the criteria in Nana requirements now? Yet, we'll be a man wherever you want to. You and I, you took five to send here. Yeah, you know, yeah, I will do my way more. And it's any news. But my point is, why the best shot that pass that I deal with me, team, because member second, I'm a person. And no more yet serious. No, a, big, a big question. A big question but but we're moving moving away from that. I mean, let's end this discussion briefly mm. because we're every day beyond. I try to say many harries. We won't come on. 
the last topic I'm saying in an opaya panel discussion, they spoke about how consciously they can move the tourism industry away. focus away from just the urban mm -hmm. or the cities mm -hmm. to the rural communities. Mm -hmm. Let's extend this conversation to the whole of Africa and uh, probably Ghana. How can Africans or Ghanaians, how and then the bit of yeah, the tourism, no? Because menu can say say bad Ghana, they are they are boy a home body, but I think say the bit of more mm -hmm. because the whole city is in the yeah. maintenance culture and yet mm -hmm. it's then the bit of my Africans mm -hmm. extensively. Mm -hmm. The bit of me making sure say the rural communities and all more moon to me, sir, be moon to me and back location, no more so much me some infrastructure mm -hmm. and some level of education. No more no tourism now for enjoying. I benefit your movie. Now, uh, yeah, tourism, tourism. I like to call it. I like to term it organic tourism. Mm. Organic tourism in the sense that when you look at our ecosystem, um, you nim say you can't a um a um pollution ne sani man yema na encroak a um carbon oxide ne carbon em emissions ne sani man yema we nyina yem say yeah yeah has say no Africa no. Yeah, your produce to crane and drew percentage be a ketwa compared as compared to a crua kasia kasi or more industrialized ya or mono or more produces a carbon emissions na aye problem a the same a ye a we are singing na a ye you and no one more can you now fat to a moment to say or motion or money be a home. In see a hano milk can say organic tourism a ha. And it was Africa to me, the name maybe to two years. It says that South Africa is being quite deliberate about pushing South Africa conscious, effort. conscious effort to push South Africa to the world. I think that the only thing that is that is that the only thing that is that the only thing about moving tourism away or inclusivity it's not that it's not necessarily to leave the urban area mm. and then move to the exactly. rural area yeah, this is account. coming together bringing mm. all of them on board inclusivity no sana extra in as much as you pay attention to the cities when it comes to tourism i think we need to um you know do same when it comes to the rural communities as well another rural area also needs maximum attention and effort in promoting what we have in our rural communities in a sense that you can't unemployment Obesha won't say and for be brief your crana say and migrate to the urban cities just to get jobs. So they can also put something on the table at the end of the day. Bread and butter issue is a serious issue, ba. And the solution is you cru 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 you know, lined up a lot of concerns. Uh, I was a buying the other any of my age, my friend. And I think, like, who could you feel it would be new and crassy? If you mean, I don't know about you because me, yeah, who will crew, you know, they will be a crassy and see, yeah, yeah, won't know, yeah, per se, yeah, back together. Send a bay uncle for bar or be per se, or be quite crassy. If we be more crana, a bay and a say, you try for be a mano. Now you didn't maybe have to do your security, your safety, lights will work. No, I can't help you. No, sometimes these yes. people do these things for, exactly. for you know, just for, for leisure. What you say? In this year, we shall say, I trust any man we are. You be critique a new man. A training capacity building training. So you are very important because me can say me call a Morocco. Cities now you call in your number. Sad another you call Morocco. You can go experience in Morocco. You can be discuss it. I will go and have say no. Yet no I can no near what translator tour guide no tour guide no or can or more casa or can some or more indigenous languages no or can and no casa ni na no or sign obi asa e da a translate na beyond that language barrier no ne ye ni die the knowledge and this was an old man. Ah, what you say? Institutional, and I don't know institutional memory. What you say? What's in a tourism sector? What's it? You have a lot of information. Only knowledge, only history. And maybe our course school, I'm going say training and in presentation. How are we to talk to you? I'm going to have a whole year of bedding. Or be banner at the end of the day. Now, while we are with you, I say, I'm going to have a whole year of bedding. I'm going to have a whole year of bedding. I'm going to have a whole year of bedding. I'm going to have a whole year of bedding. I'm going to have a whole year of bedding. 
we have to be very very deliberate about it thank you so much um harriet harriet works with pan african uh, television and i host diplomatic affairs diplomatic affairs diplomacy yeah she has a lot of information so like i mentioned earlier every day be an better i say the information mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Especially Ghana, especially Ghana, So God bless you so much. Uh, behind the camera is Peter. God bless you. My name is Kobe Che. Uh, keep following me. And uh, this is Endeba 2023. God bless you. Yes. And big shout out to Mr. Daniel Kwashi. And much yes. appreciation to the High Commissioner the high of South Africa to yes. Ghana, the Her Excellency Grace, Grace Janet Mason. Mason. God bless you so much. <laughs>